so this is a really important step in the search bar type task manager and then click here to open it this will open a new window task manager then on this window we need to click on file select run new task and then click here so you need to follow my screen uh, we need to open c drive so click here and then open c drive now open windows folder then open system32 folder Just scroll down and search for cmd and then click on open now check this box select ok these commands are really important uh, you can manually type these commands or to avoid mistakes you can simply copy and paste these commands from the page I will show you for that open Google Chrome and then in the search bar type google.com and hit enter then in the search bar type house.take windows commands and hit enter now from the search results click on this link which is from www.house.take and then just scroll down and search for command number 12 and then right click here and select copy and to paste this command on the command form right click here select edit and simply click on paste then hit enter to execute this command after that copy command number 13 so right click and select copy and then simply paste this command on command prompt then hit enter after that type exit to close this window go to search bar and type here cmd right click on it and select run as administrator now select as to avoid mistakes uh, you will get this command in the description below just copy and paste on command prompt once done hit enter and execute it after that close the command prompt window the next search for command prompt again run as administrator now paste this command before that open C drive open windows folder just scroll down and open system32 folder then select this file right click on it select properties just copy this the name of the file and paste it here to paste that right click here select edit and just select paste and hit enter to execute it now click on ok again paste that file name and hit enter now you can follow my screen again once done we need to close the command prompt window finally restart the system which is very important before you do that, like this video, God bless.